Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Tonight's dinner, we're making a slow cooker buffalo chicken sandwiches. So, these are the um, list of ingredients you're gonna need. You're gonna need some cooking spray, just to spray the inside of your slow cooker. You're going to need three pounds of boneless, skinless chicken breast, one bottle of um, Frank's Red Hot Wing Buffalo Sauce, and one packet of ranch seasoning mix. So the first thing we're gonna do while we are, um, while we get everything ready, I'm gonna go ahead and get my slow cooker plugged in and get it sprayed. Um, just in that way it will be nice and sprayed for us. So that it kind of oil, nice and oiled down to make sure the chicken doesn't stick. Okay, now we're gonna get our chicken. Now this is, um, three chicken breasts going into our slow cooker, I think. So these, now, these are big chicken breasts, so I don't really think we're gonna, you know, this will be fine. Um, I've kind of, we've done, now, we've discussed this before with chicken, is that you don't want the fat. So any fat that you see, it's fine, because it's all gonna be in there. It's gonna cook for a long time, so it'll be fine. Okay, so I'm going to get my ranch packet open. And I know usually we, we wash our hands first, but I'm gonna be touching the chicken anyway, so it's, you know, it makes more sense to do your messy ingredients first. You know what I mean, guys? Okay, so. Now, if you wanted to make this recipe um, a different way, you can do that. It doesn't matter because the recipe that I usually do, this is the exact same recipe I make. Now, if I was making something like buffalo chicken, um, like buffalo chicken dip, you guys know that recipe I've shared with you before. That recipe, hold on, let me, let me actually do this. Let's walk, okay, let me do this. I'm gonna wash my hands and then we'll get the rest of the ingredients in our slow cooker just to make it easier. Okay, so this recipe, is a very simple, very fast recipe to make. It's not really that difficult. Um, you're using minimum ingredients, which is great. This recipe is a, I, I, now I wouldn't say it's a low carb recipe. Well, actually I would say that actually. It is like a low carb recipe because mine's chicken. Let me actually zoom in here. So that way you guys can kind of see there we go, the slow cooker and stuff and whatnot. Okay, let's open this ranch again. Now, remember, with this recipe, you can adapt this recipe. I'm using three chicken breasts, which is great for the slow cooker because the crock pot, you obviously know, this recipe will feed my whole family. Now, if I was making this for a smaller family, Say if you had a family of like four or six, you could adapt this recipe in any way, shape, or form you want. It does not matter. Now, my recipe that I have on my channel is very simple to make. Um, now, the only reason I say that is because it's not really that difficult for us to make. It's very simple. It's very easy, and the best part is this recipe, we've done this before. So, all right, so what we're gonna do now is just get our ranch on this chicken. Now, the whole purpose of this recipe is to make sure that it coats your chicken. So, what I'm gonna do next um, in this recipe is we're gonna pour in one bottle of French Red Hot Buffalo Sauce into this crock pot with the chicken, okay? So we're kinda gonna use the same tool we used to open that ranch packet. We're gonna use a knife just to kinda get it to be open, just so we can get it open, okay? Now, um, a quick tip for you guys. If you guys don't wanna make this with buffalo sauce, you don't have to do it with buffalo sauce. I've done this recipe with, um, Um, I've done this recipe with um, barbecue sauce, and it's good. 
Um, you could do this recipe with any sauce you want. If you don't want buffalo sauce, like let's see this, right? If your family doesn't care for spicy food, then you don't have to make it with buffalo sauce. You could make it with, um, you could make it with uh, barbecue sauce. If you guys have seen my slow cooker barbecue um, pulled chicken video, then you guys know this is the exact same recipe. We're just using bar, um, excuse me, we're just using buffalo sauce um, instead of barbecue. That's the only difference. And we're using a ranch packet. So we're gonna use this whole bottle. And it looks like a lot right now. But as this cooks on low, and you want it to like cover your chicken quite a bit, okay? You want it to cover that chicken. Now what I'm gonna do to this bottle is because I know there's a lot of goodness left, I'm gonna put a little bit of water into it. Now I know that, I know that's crazy. I know that's a little crazy adding water, but it's gonna make it real, real good and real, real thick as it cooks for a few hours. It's gonna be so yummy. Now, before we shake that up, I'm gonna clean up my mess. Make sure I got all the ranch out, cause you know, you can't be too careful, right? Okay, so now what I'm gonna do to the slow cooker, I'm going to, um, huh, you know, I have a little bit of liquid too, cause you need your, you wanna make sure you have a little extra sauce in your crock, right? You wanna make sure that it's nice and coated. If you know what I mean, you guys, you guys have seen me do this recipe before, so you guys are pretty familiar with the recipe. Now, if you guys don't want to, um, like I said, if you guys don't need buffalo, it's fine. You could use barbecue sauce instead, and it's, it still smells great. So we're gonna add this. This is gonna cover the chicken, which is what I want. I want my chicken to be completely covered in everything. That's perfect. So. If I kind of drop this a little bit, you guys can kind of see that. That's what you want. Every, it's all covered. It's perfect. So I'm going to put it in my base. I'm going to cover it. I'm going to put it on low and we're going to cook it for about four, somewhere between four to six hours. Um, you want your chicken to pretty much be falling apart. And once it falls apart, I'll come back and I'll show you what that looks like. And then we will shred it with our, um, we will shred it with the meat cloths, which I have here. And I'm gonna serve it, um, it's gonna be buffalo chicken sandwiches. So I have some buns here. See, I have some buns here. And I'm also gonna serve it with um, some chips on the side. So that'll be our dinner tonight. All right, I'm just gonna cover it up. And we're gonna cook it on low for about four to six hours. So this is another great slow cooker dinner. Now the reason why I'm not making this tomorrow is because tomorrow's my birthday. So if you guys, if you guys could wish me a happy birthday, please leave them in the comments below. But we decided to make this tonight for dinner, and why not, right? I love slow cooking. So lid on, put it on low for four to six hours until the chicken is nice and tender, and then I'll come back, I'll shred it up, and we'll show you what it looks like. So let's get it started. So we're gonna go to select. We're gonna do all the way to six hours. I'm gonna put it on low, and there you go. All right, so lids on, we're gonna cook it on low for six hours, and then we'll come back and we'll show you what it looks like. All right, that's it. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. I'll be back in six hours to show you what it looks like. Bye, log on, peace out, boom. Okay, bye guys.